As a groundbreaking writer, creator, and producer of hit TV shows and films, Mara Braca Kiel has parlayed her Medill education into an award-winning career. She was born in Los Angeles, California, and moved to Kansas City, Missouri when she was eight years old. She stayed there until high school graduation. She applied only to Northwestern University and came to campus for the first time as a freshman in the fall of 1988. As a Medill student, she volunteered with her sorority, Delta Sigma Theta, planned the annual tribute to black men, and wrote for the black sketch comedy group, Out the Box. During this time, she began to realize that the media was not inclusive to the kinds of stories that interested her, so she decided she would tell the truth through fiction. Toward the end of her time at Northwestern University, Bronca Keel finally got into the screenwriting class she'd been eyeing since freshman year. She fell in love with the craft, changing her life's trajectory and TV as a whole. Her first job in the industry was as a staff writer for TV shows South Central and Moesha. She then developed her first original series, Girlfriends. It debuted in 2000. The show quickly became known as the Black Sex and the City among fans. Girlfriends ran for eight seasons and became the longest running black sitcom, only second to The Cosby Show. Girlfriends' success gave birth to its spinoff, The Game, which aired in 2006 for three seasons. BET later revived the show, drawing in a record-breaking 7.7 million viewers. In 2011 and 2012, Brock Akeel and husband Salim produced and released films Jumping the Broom and Sparkle under their production company, Akeel Productions. Sparkle starred the late Whitney Houston in her final work. In 2013, Brock Akeel created BET's first scripted drama, Being Mary Jane. The show is currently in its fourth season. Her latest projects represent Black Love and the Black Family. Two new shows are underway for the 2016-2017 pilot season. Brock Akeel lives in Los Angeles. She derives the most joy from raising her two sons with her husband of 20 years.